In this chapter, we will discuss about creating a list and on our list. Inserting image in the web page. Click on start button. In search programming file, you can type notepad. Press enter. This is notepad text editor. Here we can type HTML tags. Now, let's begin with some basic tags. HTML head title. Let's just close the head here only. If you want to specify title, you can type title here. Suppose use of use of order and on order list. Just close the title you can hear. If you don't need to if you are if you do not want to set any title you can just close the title like here without writing anything now let's close body with slash close the html also now in this space or in this area it is body in this body area you can design you can type any tags that you want to browse in the browser as web page now here we want to display order list or we want to display any text in bulleted style or bulleted form or in number form so let's see an example let's give a heading like h1 now you can type like most popular places of Nepal now let's list out in bulleted or number form first let's use numeric style for listing you can use ol to begin order list now let's type ol now in first list li you can use li tab to list out the items now li katmandu li pokhara li chitomon li karnali Eli Taran. Here I have written name of five places in and that I want to list out. Now close the tags. Order tag. You need to close order tag. O and here we have begin with OL tag and we have listed out the items with li 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 tag so now just save the tags go to file menu click on save option now choose the location where you want to save suppose inside libraries inside documents here i have to type the name of this file use of order list dot html or stm now click on save option now just minimize this text editor 
computer libraries that means use of order list this is our HTML document now just double click on it to open or right click and click on open the order list is being opened in web browser see this is heading one okay and here you can see the listing of the popular places of Nepal in one two three four in five format or in numeric format it is different format of our list we can also use different attributes for order list for example just minimize this internet explorer go to a browser now display order list in different format we need to use attribute attribute of order list now go inside order list space now you can specify attribute like type equal to equal to capital A if you specify the attribute like this now save it just file menu save option now go to browser right click refresh what is here you can see the listed items are in capital A B C D E format it means if you type capital A in attribute you can list out items in capital A B C D E continuously in this format similarly if you type I if you type I in order list type what happens let's see go to file menu save it go to browser just replace it what is here you can see the items are being listed in Roman okay like this you can change the attribute of order list or way of listing go again in the text editor if you type a small letter a here a small a what happens let's see go to web browser save the text go to web browser and refresh see you can see cap small a b c d e or small alphabeticals in listing like this you can change the attribute go again in the text editor small i here now save it and go to web browser and refresh see the number are the items are being listed in lower roman by default it means without giving any attribute items are listed in numeric format 1 2 3 for example if you remove this attribute again then items are listed in number form 1 2 3 4 5 like this go to save option now go to browser and refresh see the items are being listed in numeric format this is the default or automatically displayed items in the web browser on order list to use on order list you need to use ul ul you can begin with ul now again you can use li like pcb highway Li Siddharth Highway Similarly Li Ratna Highway Similarly 
पुष्पलाल हाई भाई Like this, we can list out the items. Now, here we have we have begin with UL tag, and we have listed out the popular highways of Nepal. Now you can close this on our list here with closing UL tag. Simply on our list. Where we don't find any series of numbers. Here only the here only you can see the use of dots or points or we can use symbols also here or a square format of bulleted style or dot style of bulleted style we can use. But here we cannot use number. So this type of style is called on our list. Here you don't you don't see any type of order. You kun poilo kun dosro. You don't see any order here. But in here you can see in order in order format. It is the difference. Now in on order list also we can use some attribute. Let's go to text editor again. Inside this on order list type attribute. For example, in order list we can. Specify attribute inside order list or OL tag, but in all order list we can specify attribute inside li tag. For example, li space type equal to square. Now just save the tags. Go to browser. Now refresh. What do you see? Here you can see. The changing in order list and see change in on order list. Next, go to text editor again. Now, let's use another type. Suppose li type equal to equal to disc. This. Now, save the text. Go to browser. Refresh. What is here? It is in bulleted form. Now again. Go to text editor again. Now li type equal to circle. Now save the text. Go to browser. Refresh. What is here? You can see only a circle in on order list. This is output for order list and. Output for another list. Let's close it. Now let's learn how to insert image in web page. You can type title here. For example, inserting images in the web pages. Now this is. Body opening tab. Now close this body tab. Close HTML tab. Now in this area, in this area, you can use various tags for inserting images. For example, here IMG tag for inserting images. IMG. Now it is singular tag or on pair tag. It does not have closing tag. Now inside this image tag, you need to specify attribute. For example, img src equal to. Now our species in the just minimize the window. Now go to the any location of computer where you have saved picture. For example, inside libraries, inside pictures, I have saved some pictures here. Now I want to insert this image as in web page. Now just right click on this picture, click on properties. Here you can see a complete address of 
picture you can see location here just copy it S paste your left mouse button and drag okay now right click on it here you can see copy option click on copy तपाई यो एड्रेस लाई समझिन पनि सक्नुहुन्छ अथवा कुनै टेक्स्ट मा लेखेर पनि तपाईले राख्न सक्नुहुन्छ जसलाई चाहिँ तपाईले यो एड्रेस हो स्पेसिफाई गरेर राख्न सक्नुहुन्छ और हियर आई हैव कॉपीड जस्ट सेलेक्ट दी लोकेशन राइट क्लिक ऑन इट क्लिक ऑन कॉपी नाउ द लोकेशन हैज बीन कॉपीड नाउ लेट्स गो टू द टेक्स्ट एडिटर इनसाइड दिस सोर्स लोकेशन जस्ट पेस्ट क्लिक ऑन एडिट मेनू क्लिक ऑन पेस्ट और राइट क्लिक पेस्ट सो हियर inside c drive inside users inside dell inside pictures folder we have artist the image name is artist so just you can type slash a r t i s t artist dot now you can give the extension of image j p g now just save go to file menu click on save now go to web browser Now refresh. See, the picture has been displayed because you can find out the picture extension from here also. Like, go to picture, right click on the picture file, click on properties. Here you can see type of file. Here JPEG image inside bracket you can see dot JPEG, and this is the location of picture. Okay, so let's close it. So inside C drive users Dell pictures folder we have artist we have a picture name artist and we dot jpg extension okay like this we can insert picture if you want to insert another picture again img src equal to now double quotation mark start now you can specify any location like C drive slash users Dell pictures pictures. Now you can specify the file name. If you are Known about picture name, you can type picture name. If you are unknown about picture name, you can go to location and you can search the picture. Suppose I want to insert this car, so you can just go to text editor again. Now you can type name C A R car dot J P G. Now just close. Okay, save the. Tabs. Go to a browser. Replace. Okay. Again, another picture has been inserted in the web page. Similarly, let's go to text editor. Here, type again. I want to insert another picture. Image source equal to. Now again, just search any pictures. Open the location. Suppose inside libraries, inside pictures, inside sample pictures. I want to insert this image. Desert. Now just right click on this picture. Click on properties. Here you can see the location of picture. Just copy it. And this is JPG extension picture. So just click on OK. Now go to text editor. Now paste that. Address. Click on edit menu. Click on paste. Now slash. What is the picture name? Digit. Now capital D. S E R T. Now again go to save. Go to browser and refresh. See, the picture has been displayed on the web page. Like this, we can insert picture in web page. Similarly, you can. You don't see the size of picture here in the same. This picture is very small. It is little large, 
and it is very large picture if you want to specify the same size of picture you you need to give attribute for image now go to text editor again type of attributes you can specify the height of picture height of picture and alignment for example i want to increase or decrease i want to specify the size of picture for artist.jpg now go inside this image source tab now type suppose width width equal to 100 height equal to equal to 50 and align equal to left now just save the text go to web browser and refresh see the picture is in 100 in width and 50 in height if you want to increase the height and width again you can go to the text editor again and here type width equal to 500 height equal to 250 and align equal to left now save the text go to a browser and refresh see the picture has been aligned in left side the picture width is 500 and the height is 250 similarly this change the attribute of another picture also in 250 again align equal to right just save the text go to a browser right click and refresh see the picture is in is on right side this is alignment and the white is 500 and height is 250 let's erase this tab let's leave only two pictures now just save it you can press ctrl plus s or click on file menu click on save option now go to web browser refresh here you have only two pictures now let's set uh, tooltip tooltip means when you place your mouse pointer on the picture you can see the picture name or location or whatever you set as tooltip like when you click on file menu you can see like like this you can see tooltip here suggested sites like uh, favorites or like get more add-ons it is tooltip you can see such information even in picture also when you place your mouse pointer here on the picture you can get tooltip for example let's go to text editor again now inside this pictures image source tab type alt alt equal to now you can specify text like it is new car showing in Kathmandu it is tooltip text when someone place the mouse pointer near the picture it shows the text for example now save it go to web browser now when you place your mouse pointer here you can see the text see it is new car showing in Kathmandu so it is tooltip similarly if you place your mouse pointer here you don't see any tooltip here it means you don't see any text but again let's add tooltip to this picture also go to text editor inside this image source tab type a a l t a l t is that tag which is used to specify the tooltip 
alt equal to it is digit of Africa now just close with double quotation mark now save the text go to web browser refresh what do you see now it, you can see is digit of Africa you can see such type of tooltip like this we can add tooltip also in various websites when you visit national or international websites you can get such type of effect okay you can get the name or location of the picture